Hey there friends, welcome back to our channel, where we keep you updated on everything you need to know about senior benefits, social security, and important financial news that affects our retirement community. Today, we're diving into some big news that's been circulating about potential $5,000 stimulus payments. I know many of you have been asking about this, so let's separate fact from fiction and get to the bottom of what's really happening. First. I want to be completely transparent with you. As your trusted source for benefits information, it's crucial to note that as of today, there is no official $5,000 stimulus payment that has been approved by Congress. I know this might not be what some of you wanted to hear, but it's important we start with the truth. What we're seeing is a lot of misleading headlines and social media posts that are causing confusion among our senior community. However, don't click away just yet because there are several real benefit increases and programs that you need to know about, and I'm going to break down exactly what money is actually available to seniors, veterans, and families right now. This information is far more valuable than chasing false rumors, and I want to make sure you don't miss out on any benefits you're entitled to. Let's start with what's really happening with Social Security benefits this year. The Social Security Administration has implemented an 8.7% cost of living adjustment for 2023, which is one of the largest increases in recent history. For many beneficiaries, this means a significant boost in their monthly checks. On average, Social Security recipients are seeing an increase of more than $140 per month. This is real money that's already being distributed, unlike the rumored $5,000 payment. For our veterans in the audience, there are several legitimate programs and benefits that have recently been expanded. The PACT Act, which was signed into law, has opened up new benefits for veterans exposed to toxic substances during their service. This could mean thousands of dollars in additional benefits for eligible veterans and their families. While it's not a one-time $5,000 payment, it could actually result in much more significant long-term financial support. Now let's talk about Medicare savings programs that many seniors don't know about. These programs can save you thousands of dollars annually on healthcare costs. The Medicare savings program can help cover your Part B premiums, which is $1,664.90 per month in 2023. That's nearly $2,000 in savings per year right there. Plus, if you qualify for extra help with prescription drugs, you could save an additional $5,100 per year. These are real programs with real savings that you can access right now. Here's something many viewers might not know about the Senior Farmers Market Nutrition Program, SFMNP. This program provides low impost seniors with coupons that can be used to purchase fresh fruits, vegetables, honey, and herbs at farmers markets. While the value varies by state, this is another real benefit that can help stretch your budget. Let's address the property tax relief programs available to seniors. Many states and local governments offer property tax exemptions or deferrals for seniors over a certain age or below certain income thresholds. These programs can save you hundreds or even thousands of dollars annually on your property taxes. It's not a stimulus payment, but it's real money staying in your pocket. For those of you struggling with utility bills, there is the Low Income Home Energy Assistance Program, LEHEAP. This program helps seniors and low-income households with their heating and cooling costs. The average LEHEAP benefit can range from $200 to $1,000 or more, depending on your location and situation. This is another legitimate program that provides real financial relief. Now, let's talk about some smart financial moves you can make 
Right now, many seniors don't realize they might be eligible for the senior tax credit for the elderly and disabled. If you qualify, this credit could reduce your tax bill by up to $7,500. While this isn't a stimulus payment, it's a significant tax benefit that too many seniors miss out on. For our viewers who are still carrying mortgage debt, there's important information about the FHA's Home Equity Conversion Mortgage, HEMF, program. This government-insured reverse mortgage program can help seniors aged 62 and older access their home equity without having to make monthly mortgage payments, while this isn't free money, it's a legitimate financial tool that could provide significant monthly savings. Let's not forget about the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, SNAP. Many seniors qualify but don't apply because they think the benefit is too small to matter. However, the average SNAP benefit for senior households has increased and some recipients get several hundred dollars per month in food assistance. This is real help for your grocery budget. Here's something exciting. Many states are offering their own benefit programs for seniors. For example, some states have implemented expanded property tax relief prescription drug assistance, and even dental care programs specifically for seniors. These programs vary by state, but they're worth investigating because they could provide substantial financial benefits. I want to address the topic of scams targeting seniors, especially those related to stimulus payments. If anyone contacts you claiming they can help you get a $5,000 stimulus payment, that's a red flag. Never give out your personal information to someone promising to help you access stimulus money. All legitimate government benefits have official application processes through verified government websites or offices. For those of you caring for elderly parents or relatives, there are caregiver support programs available. Some states offer paid family leave or caregiver stipends that could provide financial assistance while you care for a loved one. These programs might not make headlines like stimulus payments, but they provide real, sustainable support. Here's a practical tip. Many seniors don't realize they can still claim missing stimulus payments from the COVID-19 era through the recovery rebate credit. If you never received your previous stimulus payments, you might still be able to claim them by filing a tax return, even if you don't normally file taxes. Let's talk about prescription drug savings under the Inflation Reduction Act. Starting in 2025, Medicare beneficiaries won't pay more than $2,000 per year for prescription drugs. While this isn't a direct payment, it could save some seniors thousands of dollars annually on medication costs. The Senior Community Service Employment Program, SCEPP, is another valuable resource. This program provides part-time job training for low-income individuals aged 55 and older. While it's not a stimulus payment, it offers both income and valuable work experience. Here's something practical you can do today. Contact your local area agency on aging. These organizations can connect you with numerous local resources, programs, and benefits that you might not know about. They can help you access meals, transportation, home care services, and other valuable assistance programs. Before we wrap up, I want to emphasize the importance of being proactive about your benefits. Don't wait for a stimulus payment that may never come. Instead, take action to access the many legitimate benefits and programs available right now. Make appointments with benefit counselors, check your eligibility for various programs, and stay informed about real opportunities to save money and access assistance. Thank you for watching, and remember, while we all wish there was a new $5,000 stimulus payment coming, it's better to focus on the real benefits and assistance programs that are actually available right now.
Stay informed, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video.